Here's what you missed on Fathead and Candy in the morning. Weekdays, 6 to 10 a.m. on My Country 96.1. My Country 96.1, Fathead Candy Roth. We're going to be uh, mid-60s, mix of clouds and rain, rain and clouds, and the usual nonsense like yesterday, Candy. So uh, if you got to go out there, uh, you know, have your little winter jacket. Have your little uh, windbreaker. You know, keep dry, okay? Okay. Okay. Good. I know, you, you, you're you sitting there waiting for the details of the big show on Saturday. Yes, I wish we had Sniffavilla. Uh, <laughs> Sniff- you know what Sniffavision? You know what I, <laughs> yes, that's it, Sniffavision. Uh, yeah, I did attend the Keith Urban show at UBS Arena Saturday night, Candy. Uh, it, where do you want me to start? I mean, we it's a lot to well, tell. Well, I'm waiting to hear about how great he smells. We could start there. All right, we'll start with uh, me and Dana going backstage to see uh, all of them, Keith, Tyler Hubbard, and Ingrid Andres. Yeah, you had a bunch of people with you. Yeah, so we took, uh, I had invited Leah's tennis team, her varsity tennis team, to the show. Uh, and I don't even think you're talking about that. You're talking about my family? Is that what you're... I just knew you were taking a bunch of people with yeah. you. Yeah, so we'll start there. I, I had um, uh, Keith and the and the folks there were uh, kind enough to uh, invite, um, you know, I told them about the team and everything, and they uh, helped me invite the whole tennis team, which they were so uh, uh, excited about. And uh, some of them couldn't make it. There were a few that... Uh, couldn't be there, and uh, we had invited uh, the coaches and stuff, but only a handful could make it. But we had a total of, I I think there were seven, I want to say seven of the girls were there, um, yep. plus uh, a couple other friends. And, yeah, we, we had a couple friends with us and uh, another friend of Leah's and everything. It was, it was great. They had a great time. Very uh, happy to hear that. We put, the, we put the girls and Abigail and Elijah in in their own row they had their own space they were like they were happy to be away from us they were having a good time candy so uh they enjoyed now as far as uh the show itself dana and i uh were the only ones allowed to go backstage because of restrictions and you know it is covid uh, flu season all that stuff going on so uh me and her go back there we we see ingrid andress she was great um uh had a had a great set tyler hubbard was fantastic. The crowd was really berserk for Tyler Hubbard. They oh. enjoyed. He was awesome. Yep, and uh, and he put on a great show for us at Mulcahy's not long ago, uh, August thirtieth. And then uh, we got to hang with Keith. We were chatting with him probably for close to a half hour. Kid. Really chatting about what? About if you'd like to know, there were a few things going on. He had yeah. He had mentioned. Um, uh, that his oldest daughter was at a school dance that night, a, a date, oh. if you will. Oh, and, yes, with a family friend, and uh, and they were, uh, you know, we were chatting about that and how he was thinking about his daughter, who was who was out there with, uh, uh, you know, a school dance and a boy yeah, and everything. Yeah, that's the rough thing being on the road. You miss yeah. these little little times. But, uh, yeah, he said the, uh, the it was a family, very close family friend, so he wasn't too nervous about it, and it was all good. Uh, but things like that, you know, his his kids are the same age as Leah and Abigail. They're the, oh, that's yeah. right. So um, we're chatting a little bit about that, a little bit about the tour and some other things. I mean, uh, the big news, Candy, though, a lot of people are inquiring. He smelled magnificent. This is what I want to know. Um, and he, I, you know, I, again, it's probably, uh, a special cologne. Maybe it's his own cologne. He smelled amazing. The man never, sm- and he never smells just generic. He never smells like just mm. soap and water, right? He, mm. he just, um, he smelled like, uh, the most gorgeous, uh, perfumed, uh, man I've ever been around. I mean, it's I just- want to smell him so bad. Was Dana then- hanging on for dear life? Oh yeah, Dana was go would almost not let go, of course, and um, you know. Excuse security, security. Can we get security <laughs> for a minute? This woman will not let go of me, and she keeps smelling me. It's 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 a little much. Yeah. Uh. So it was uh it was sort of like that, but uh, no, he he uh, um, you know, he was happy to be there at the arena. 
uh, that he had never played before, the UBS Arena. Um, another interesting story about the evening is that his regular drummer, uh, his wife gave birth um, the day before Friday. Yes, Thursday. His wife gave birth Thursday. So he had to leave and go home for the birth or to see the baby, whatever. So they had a relief drummer come in Friday night in Connecticut at Mohegan Sun. Guy came, literally flew in, learned 20-something songs, and hit the stage with them Friday night. And the second show that he drummed with Keith Urban was our show, Saturday night at UBS Arena. Wow, look at that. And he was great. I mean, you never would have known. You wouldn't have been able to tell. Um, and the show was great. He was great. I Honestly, the thing that made me feel best was the girls, uh, Leah and all her friends and everything, they had just a blast. And a lot of them came out of there. You know, some of them were country fans. Some of them were not country fans. But uh, after the show, they were all like, oh, my God, I can't believe this. Is, like, this is not what we expected because Keith puts on a rock and roll party. I mean, it's re- it's... If you have never seen a country music show or had never seen Keith Urban, you would be blown away, Candy. He is still, in my mind, I think I said this five years ago, the last time we saw him, he is still the best entertainer in the format, and it's not even close. Wow. Yeah. And I could say that, honestly, without reservation. And, you know, there's a lot of artists we love, um, from Eric Church, to uh, whoever, pick your, you know, uh, we're going to see Lee Bryce this week at Westbury. Uh, Candy, I will tell you, there is no better entertainer in this format. The guy is, ju- he, he's he's incredible, start to finish, two hours long. Yeah. Yeah. So, well, you had a great time. I'm so happy. And the girls, we did. that's what makes it so special. Yeah, we did, the girls, and uh, got to hang Any with the- Any pictures f- of uh, you and Keith? Uh, yeah, there's a bit here. Hold on. Let's, well, uh, I didn't get believe, that. Any can't believe I didn't. Dana and Keith? Can't believe I didn't. Why do I have to ask for these I, things? So, uh, yeah, there's, so it's funny. There's two pictures, one with Keith in the middle, one with Dana in the middle, and the one with Dana in the middle, she can easily crop me out, you know, so, uh, here, I'll you send. You said it, not me. I know. Well, even Keith said it. Keith said, let's put her in the middle if she wants to crop you out. <laughs> I like him already. Yes. Very... Very good stuff. I'm sending. Let me know when you get it. Should be there any second. Looks like it's there. I mean, tell me he doesn't look 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 how perfectly put together. He's got this nice denim, dark denim jacket. You see this? You got this? I didn't get it yet. No. Oh, come oh, on. Here we come. Let's see. Take a peek. Look at the outfit. I mean, he looks. Doesn't he just look like he smells fantastic? Why did I think he was short? Um. No. He's uh. He's. Uh, Regular, yeah, he's like it looks a little taller than you. Yeah, I mean, I don't know if it's the angle or not, but he's probably I'm five eleven. He's probably five eleven, six feet somewhere in there. Yeah. Look at sweet Dana with her hair all done up. Yeah, she did the curls and the whole like thing. Like it. Yeah. So does that suit your uh, needs there? It you does. I like it. He looks great, and he always has his hair highlighted. He's wearing. A... I could just almost smell him. Yes. Yeah. He, uh, he was great, and the show was great. Uh, I also, by the way, a couple other things from this weekend. I visited Spirit Halloween. Have you ever been to this store, Spirit I Halloween? I have not. But you've seen it, right? In your I travels? I have not. Okay. They they take over, like, empty storefronts and open up, uh, you know, a month or so, two months before Halloween. But um, I spent, I, I took Elijah, and then I took Abby. I'll tell you, it's, uh, they got some racket over there. The price is at Spirit Halloween. I'm like, you know what? Next year, you're going to make your own costume out of uh, Ooh, whatever. And what did they choose? Uh, Elijah is a, as he calls it, a psycho bunny. He has oh. this uh, this bunny hat. You know, it almost looks like Mass Singer. As a matter of fact, he filmed uh, a video pretending he was the Mass Singer yesterday, uh, taking the hat off. I'll have to send that to you. Uh, so he's the psycho bunny. Abigail, I don't know, she's wearing like a scream mask and a tutu and so she's it's very cute so uh uh we did that and then leah yesterday uh yesterday evening around the end of the giants game as i was trying to uh watch and and see online how the giants were going to hold on for victory uh she started another winter session she now goes sunday and monday for her her uh fall and winter tennis 
sessions. So we had that last night, the match play yesterday, and uh, it was a very busy weekend. We were out and about. I you know? see. Look at that. Well, the family looks great. Glad you're all well. Thank what you. else do you got? Nothing. I went to bed later, sa- Saturday into Sunday. I went to bed about one thirty in the morning. That's the latest I've gone to bed, I'd have to say, in, I don't know, a decade at least. Wow. <laughs> I, I I just don't see Are you up all that right? Way. Yeah, well, we were out at the Keith Urban show. So yeah, I see. you know, had no choice and right. it is what it is. Yeah. Yeah. We had a great time. All right. We're uh, less than twenty minutes to your bald and the beautiful entertainment, everything from Nashville to Hollywood. Uh mid sixties, cloudy and rain. We hit the roads. My country, 96.1. Fathead and Candy in the morning, weekdays, six to ten AM on My Country, 96.1.